Well, let's turn to other stories now. It was a day of glowing tributes for, for the late spokesman of Afeni Ferry, Yinka Odumaki, as many dignitaries, including Speaker of the House of Representatives and the Governor of Lagos State, took turns to celebrate his life and times. Plus TV, Africa's senior correspondent, Kayodi Ladindi, reports. <laughs> For many keen observers, this is a gathering of creme de la creme in Nigeria, though of opposing political views. Interestingly, many who do not share same views with Yinka Odumaki acknowledged that he was a man of conviction who is worth emulating. Leading the tribute, the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabiamila, and Governor Babajide Sonwulu of Lagos State, asked the audience to be consoled by the legacy he left behind. My knowledge of him was based on admiration, admiration of his qualities, of what he stood for, of what he represent and of who he was. I came to know from the distant a man who had been through so much vicissitudes so of life, twists and turns, but who in all of it stood straight. Until the very end, he kept going. He kept speaking up. He kept working hard for a Nigeria that we all can be truly proud of. For a Nigeria that will be a land of justice, a Nigeria that will be fair, a Nigeria where equity will become the watchword, and a Nigeria that will truly reflect true modern federalism. Others recall their close relationship with him and the lessons learned from his principled stand. Comrade lies there. But one thing that is reassuring, one thing that will never make me break down, one thing that will make me want to come back and stay with an activist of note like him is that his ideas will live forever. His legacies will remain. All that he has lived for will remain in the sound print of time. And Inca, you are not dead. You are alive. I'm therefore challenging all the authorities of our universities, starting with Obafemi Awolowo University, because the management, the management had come out to say that Nyinka was an illustrious alumnus of that great institution. What made Nyinka an illustrious alumnus was that he was developed by the student union. That student union has been proscribed indefinitely. Therefore, the best tribute that if authorities can pay to Yinka is to restore, to deproscribe the University of Ife student union, or Bafemi Awolowo student union. Uh, and he has remained close uh, all the way. Yinka has always been about the course, a man of conviction. Yinka would put everything into whatever he believed in. He never rested for one day. He was always fighting for the cause. Yinka believed in a better, in a, in a better one Nigeria. Many have re-echoed the words of Mr. President when he described Yinka as a man of conviction. One thing is clear here, that what he stood for will continue to resonate in the minds of many. From Ikeja here in Lagos, Kaya De Ladeni reporting for PLUS TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.